Yeah, what's up, what's happening? My name is Files, aka Files, the bad guy. Ladies and gentlemen, they're also calling me the what's up guy. And right now, I just want to inform you that you are officially on the journey with Nayoka. So fasten your seatbelt and enjoy the ride. Thank you so much. Kisses. Uh, bad guys. <laughs> Soft work. Sex. Uh, I been in B, you will know when we hand talent. They say we the show gun, it's a damn habit. We no struggle to collect best status. First class, no be who collect extra shit. Give ladies ecstasy with our hex parties. We call it shots, but them know they get service. When we come out London, we go check parties. I the smell heavy, I the tech malice. Uh, yeah. Oh, soja no go die, yo. <laughs> Baby boy no go tie, yo. <laughs> Face cap, I lose on chase. We are in the clubhouse on the Sunday. Uh, Star play alone, Paulo. You gon' know we make money, no be smaller. Uh, and our babes no go old, no. Bobby no go follow. You the pop button when you day club. But your rent, they hard you to pay up. You the old money since last year. When a brown new Jeep, when you drive here. You the possible give this van get. You the tell me they say you will die yet. So you get seven babes, you the take shine. And you promise all marriage at the same time. And you Files. Hello, how are you? I'm very well, thank you. Welcome to the journey. Thank you so much. It's an absolute pleasure to host you. Oh, uh, same here, same here. What else? Cool. Now, I was at the One African Music Fest. Mm. Your performance was sensational. Thank you so much. Like when you came out with your squad, I was like, oh my gosh, which one is foul? I was really, I was like hopping around myself, yeah. get, really getting into it. Yeah. Now, unfortunately, due to the time factor, your performance was cut short. Oh, yeah. Can you tell us what else you had in store for your fans? Because we were all excited to see yeah. you on stage. Um, I took a few hops out of the atmosphere. Mm -hmm. you know, uh, I follow the performance uh, chronological speaking. Mm -hmm. You hope so. I didn't perform bad, 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 bad. That is a strong record. Files, I'm, t I'm trying to take in so much from you. <laughs> that is a record that comes with so much of energy. Mm -hmm. So I'm just about to unleash. You're about to unleash it. I'm just getting to the, That's right. pool, to the climax. Mm -hmm. And they cut me short. I so know. I no problem. But we enjoyed it. Yeah, Regardless, yeah. we absolutely no, loved I, it. I, I, I enjoyed myself on the stage as well because, um, like you said, right from the entrance, video squad, mm -hmm. black, like everything, Max on the face, nobody knew what was happening. That's what I'm saying. It was, it, it was electric. Was that your creative thinking? Did you? My team. Was that My really? Team. Mm. Okay, you got yeah. a good strong team. Yeah, let's thing before every performance, we sit down, we mm -hmm. brainstorm, rub mind together. Okay. Understand romance each other mind and then mm -hmm. from there we're able to come up with some new ideas. Wonderful. Now last year you were voted the viewers choice best international act yeah. by BT. B E T That is amazing. That's B -E -T. incredible. It's so, huge. Thank you so much. Thank you. How did you feel about that? Um made me to feel so happy. Mm -hmm. I feel so happy because it's an international accomplishment. Uh, oh, if I yes. to, if I'm able to get an award back at home, it's good, it's big, it's wonderful. But then when you're able to get something from the abroad, this goes to show that in the overseas, they are watching you. They recognize, they recognize that you are working. <laughs> you have put in that work. We are yeah. proud of you. I feel so Oh, so I will wipe them away for you. Strong man with beer, beer. <laughs> Now, we know you as Fowls, yeah. but you are Fowls the bad guy. Yeah. Bad guy is an acronym for what? Tell me. B-A-H-D. Mm -hmm. so kind of bad guy is a very different kind of bad guy. Okay. I one with the positive connotation. Yes. Brilliant and highly distinct. Love it. Yeah. How did you come up with it? It's just um, something that really depicts my character as a person. Mm -hmm. I'm somebody so different. I'm so unique. In nature, if you listen to my music, you mm -hmm. observe it. If you look at the way I conduct myself, you observe a very unique. Mm -hmm. So I'm still for something that really reflects that, and that's it. I like that. Thank you. I like that very much. Now, in 2009, things really took off for you. Yeah. But before then, when you were in school, you formed a group called the Schoolboys. That is correct. With one of your friends or a couple of your friends. Yeah. Now, if you could take the experience that you have now mm -hmm. and go back in time and apply it then, mm. what one thing would you take? Because you could have become Fowls the bad guy back then mm. and been as successful as you are now. Again, again. <laughs> Ooh, wow, wow, wow. If there is one thing I can take from now, mm -hmm. is don't stop. Yes. Don't stop. Mm -hmm. Keep going. That's the lesson I've learned in uh, recent time. That's something I observed that 
consistency. Mm -hmm. It's the most important thing in life. Mm -hmm. right, so I just will not stop. Wonderful. I'll keep going. I'll keep going. Because eventually mm -hmm. it will happen for you. Definitely. Cool. Now your parents, Mr. and Mrs. Falana, did I get that correct? Falano. Falano. Mm. Falano. It's not Falana, but yeah, Falano. but it's Falano. Yeah. Okay, thank you for that. Well, if you're English, I can forgive. No, 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 no. I'm African. Let's okay. go with Falano. Okay. Okay. Yeah? You're not born in London. Yes, but let's you know, hey, let's perspective. So no, 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 no. I'm Ghanaian. <laughs> okay, so they are renowned lawyers, and you have a um, a degree, an honors LLB degree yes. in law as well. I'm barrister. You are uh, LLB BL. Wow. Yeah, you have to call it, call it complete. I will yeah. try that maybe L -L later on. LLB, LLB, comma, LLB, comma, BL. Yeah, because the LLB is different from the BL. Right. LLB is what you obtain in the university. Mm -hmm. BL, you obtain after the law school. Wow. Yeah. So you're a qualified lawyer? Qualified barrister. Do you, qualified barrister, do you plan to, you know, pursue that career later on in I life? Did, I did practice for maybe two years, so 2014, 2015. Mm -hmm. But then, after some time, they come incredibly difficult. I can understand. Because in the court of law, people stop me. So, the first bad guy. I know you. you are <laughs> so it's a bit difficult to defend the client mm -hmm. when I'm being identified as the bad guy. Right? Yeah. That makes so sense. So I know how the client can put his trust in me mm -hmm. as his lawyer. When Knowing I'm who you guy. are. It's, it's, it's very tough. It's very I difficult. understand that. Was that your plan A or your plan B? Did you always plan to do music before <coughs> becoming a barrister? <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. That's okay. No. Initially, mm -hmm. I have to follow my father for style. Mm. Father and my mother. Yeah. Renowned lawyer in Nigeria. So I thought, okay, wonderful stuff. I look at them. Mm -hmm. They are high content. Yeah. I look at them. They really motivate my life. Mm -hmm. okay. I can be like them. I can follow their first mm -hmm. But along the line, music came and stole my heart. Took over, yeah. Now, Marry Me is the song that really threw you into the limelight. Really so. I mean, and it has vocals by Yemi Alade and Poe as well. That is very correct. What was your inspiration behind writing that song? When you observe the immediate environment mm -hmm. uh, in the African society, there is a fever. Like yeah. Married fever. Yeah. So a young true. lady of maybe mid 20s mm -hmm. um, or early 20s, mm -hmm. between the early 20s and uh, 30 years of age, they do face a certain prayer. Yeah. From their own, mm -hmm. you know, family True. saying, "You need to take man. What's happening? Mm -hmm. Time is running now. So this prayer is often transferred mm -hmm. to the guys. Oh yeah, the pressure's there. The pressure's so, on. Mm. I just want to have a conversation with a young lady mm. trying to get to know her, what's mm -hmm. her name and mm -hmm. everything, and she's already asking me when I'm getting married. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> that was a bit of a situation, and it was a bit of a shock to me. I thought, why not make a song out of it? Why not put the concept into music? Mm -hmm. All that time. And I linked up with Yemi Aladi and pulled uh, magic. I loved it. The video is crazy. All of your videos are the concepts are amazing. We make Truly. Video, mm. And then it's compulsory. I yeah. Think somebody needs to be there, right? Mm -hmm. A lot of sweat, mm. time, mm. effort, possibly tears mm. goes in to producing good music. Mm -hmm. In your case, you have produced so many phenomenal songs. Now, put these in order of which one took up most of your time, you know, which one was more time consuming, which one caused you to really dig deep to find the lyrics. Soft Work, Baby Boy, and Wed Don, Sir. Did I pronounce that correctly? Wed Wed on, Sir. Wed well on, Sir. Wed on, Sir. Wed on, Sir. Ah, good. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. I'm African. Soft Work. <laughs> Baby boy. Mm. Mm. The song or the video? Let's go like with the things. song first. Uh, song wise. Because you wrote all of them, right? Of course. Yeah, let's go with them. Song wise. Song wise. Soft work. Mm. Why? So, soft work. Longest time. Because soft work, uh, if you listen to the song, it's a song that is, apart from the fact that it's having three verses, mm -hmm. it's a song that is very personal to me. Okay, tell me more. So talk is close to my heart. Because the spirit of the music mm. do reflect my character as a person, mm. as an artist, mm -hmm. reflect my struggle. You okay. Know? And it's something that I have to dig deep mm -hmm. inside to select it, bring it out, right. and place it on the record. Okay. On that, so that is why I would say that soft talk is the one mm -hmm. yeah, in terms of writing. In terms of video, yes, hmm, baby boy, okay, for life. because R&B is in that video. Mm -hmm. 
Mm. Today also call is in them. Mm -hmm. Absolute mm -hmm. legends put to them. I was wondering how you got them to the feature. Video. Yeah. Thank you. Bona is in that video. Mm -hmm. So for me able to gather everybody like this and find a sky dude that do mash up to everybody. Mm -hmm. It's tough. It's tough. So I need to be free. I need to be free. I need to be free. That's the yeah. thing. Your schedule's all over the place. So to get those legendary men in those videos, it was, it was a struggle. Mm -hmm. well, I'm, I'm grateful we're able to make it happen. Oh. Okay. Bye. Now your album. Let's talk about the stories that touch. That's stories correct, that right? Yes. It came out in 2015. Yep. Now listening to all of your songs and your lyrics. Personally, to me, I don't think you're a very emotional artist, right? You know, like people have love songs and all sorts. Your songs are very entertaining. Mm. They're danceable tracks. Yeah. Now, what is the stories that Touch album about? Did you have to dig deeper? Was it more of an emotional connection for you? Stories that Touch. Mm. The general mixture. Okay. What is it? Mm -hmm. It's a concussion. It's like when I'm trying to cook. And you just put everything inside the pot. Mm -hmm. You get it. Stories that touch is a mixture of stories of real life situations. Mm -hmm. You know, things that happen around us, things that everyone can relate to. Yes. Understand? Mm. So you listen to a record like Soja, the story of a, a junk band trying to approach a lady, mm -hmm. but you don't make it a, a, a tactic of a soldier. Mm -hmm. And the lady is telling them that will not get to nowhere. I get to me. I have a song on the record about the state of Nigeria, it's right. my people. Mm -hmm. I mentioned each and every single state capital in Nigeria on that record. That was very strong. Yes, very. Another record called Time Difference. Mm -hmm. That song is about long distance relationship. Mm -hmm. So it's a bit of different story here and there about life, about social situation that anybody can relate to. Mm -hmm. You know, something strong and magical. Mm -hmm. But there is emotional stuff there as well. So okay. It can be you know, emotional actors. I like that. Yeah, of course you can. I You're was, very diverse, you I know. I so called Love You Pass on that album. Mm -hmm. Featuring best. Can you sing it to me? It's a love song. You know, say no me, we love you pass. Baba God, no, I do. Nothing can stop it. Nothing can... <laughs> I like the way you look into my eyes. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah, I was, I was getting into you. my feelings. I was getting into it as well, you know. Yeah. You've created your own genre of music. It's called What's Up Music. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Tell me more about it. How did you even come up with that? Um, <coughs> What's Up Music. Mm -hmm. Being that my music is uh, having different elements. Yes. It's another mixture. Mixture of sand. Mm -hmm. You know, like when you're making jello fries, yeah. you place the rice in the pot. You put, uh, you put the, 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 the pepper, honey, all the spices, mm. and then eventually you get your hand. You can cook, I can tell. <laughs> right? I don't know. to be <laughs> No, I'm being <laughs> serious. Yeah, true, true. Okay, because I didn't think I got it right. <laughs> no, no. Well, there was one thing, but let's not let's not talk about that. <laughs> okay. So I have, uh, you know, I think the major element of my music, mm -hmm. you know, is that humor. You know, there's always that element of humor. So it's hip hop mm -hmm. with a mix of Fuji with a mix of high life, mm. a mix of you know local indigenous Nigerian sound, mm -hmm. all blended together, and then I'm rapping always with that element of you know in there. So we mix it all on our fun, create that blend, create that spicy jello fries. Yeah. That's so we took right. Ghanaian jello fries or Nigerian. Oh, oh, should we not go there? <laughs> let's not go. Let's, <laughs> let's, let's leave that alone. Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yes. Okay. If you could relive one moment over and over again in your life. What would it be? Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe um, getting the BT award. It's huge, right? Yeah. That's quite an accomplishment. The big stuff. Mm. Uh, you know, it was, it was a nice um, moment for me. Emotional. Good. Yeah. Emotional. It would be. Yeah. Fowls, I want to thank you so much for your time. Thank you so much. Yeah, it's been precious. It's been amazing. Absolutely. I can't wait to see what else the future has for you. Awesome. Keep watching. I, I will be watching, definitely. Now, we have a gift for you. We oh, always no. give our guests gifts. I and know. we want to just say thank you for your time. And also, congratulations on your nomination and your awards. So, this is for you. Don't have to open it now. You can just <laughs> you can peek inside if you want, you know. Okay. Get happy about no, I it. it. I don't know what's in there. So thank you so much once again for your time. Thank we appreciate you. So you. Yeah, love that. <laughs>
Make the body come pop it. I gotta find babes like say I didn't run pageant. I never get tired. It's because I'm a baby boy for life. Baby boy for life. I'm a baby boy. I'm a baby boy for life. Baby boy for life. I'm a baby boy. I'm a baby boy for life. Baby boy for life. I'm a baby boy. I'm a baby boy for life. Baby boy for life. I'm a baby boy. I'm a baby boy for life.